if there's a new hospital, then the government would be able to hire doctors and stuff for the hospital. Right. And then that would eliminate the problem of they're not being able to hire enough doctors because doctors in the, if there isn't enough room for other doctors in another hospital, then you can put it in that Okay, except... The problem here is what? What's the issue? There's not enough doctors in the remote areas of Canada. And why do you think there's not enough doctors in the remote areas? Because um, people that are graduating and they're getting jobs from like um, college and stuff, they don't want to be doctors. Okay, but what is a remote? What is a remote area? What does that mean? Small area. Yeah. Not like a province or something. It's more or less a place than an island. Well, except it's in, it, this is, a, is an issue that would happen like within like, say, Ontario or something, right? So yeah. there's not like an island. So what would you think might be like, area. is it busy if it's remote? For well, an important area. Mm -hmm. Well, I was, my um, solution was to like make a small place where emergencies go in the remote areas and then build a hospital yes. near that small place yeah. and then um, get yeah. doctors. Yeah. But but then like doctors that want people that want to be doctors yeah. and then train them in like the good hospitals or like yeah. St. Joseph's or stuff yeah. and then uh, teach them how to do all the stuff and then but because it takes a long time for the hospital to be done so once the hospital is, ho hospital is done put all bring all those doctors and nurses into that hospital. but you know what there there doesn't seem to be any doctors to come because they don't want to be in the remote areas see remote is one like okay Toronto, Hamilton, things like that, right? There's lots of people here. People want to work in busy places and busy hospitals. But the remote area is where they're like, they're isolated from everyone else. So it's like, say, one that's like way up north, right? So you go way up north, there's, it's cold, there might not be a lot of people around, you're on your own, your family doesn't live near you, maybe it's hard to get into the hospital, there's some road issues. So how are we going to try to get these people like... If we work on the concept of a new hospital, how does a new hospital up north in this like remote area, how does this help with solving the problem? But we're in but we're in Ontario, right? Say? So there is no Well making yeah. they added a new hospital north, maybe the people that live there would want to become a doctor or something. Okay, but is there any place for them to go up there to get trained? No. Yeah. Um, maybe um, the people that live in the remote areas to become doctors, like every week or so. Like it's just like going to school for a week. They would go down here and they would go to the hospital. I think it would be a waste of time to to learn everything and then go back up and then go, so I would say like... Okay, but who's going to fund them to keep coming back and forth? The government. But why would the government fund them when we have a bunch of doctors but we just don't have any in that area? Because... Well, the government... I don't know. Become deserted? Well, we got people, we just don't have a... We don't have anyone that's going to work up there. We don't have anyone that wants to work up there. Right. So how do we how do we try to get people advertise make a higher pay over there? Okay. How will a higher pay help? Because if it's like less money, there is no reason to come. First of all, because no one wants to work in a remote area. Yeah. And then if you like raise the pay, then it will be more likely for people to come there. Okay. Like we can lower taxes in that area. Oh, hold on a minute. Why lowering taxes in that area? Because. If they lower taxes in that area, then people would be able to spend more money on hiring and paying people. Right. Or if they were, let's say for the doctors, let's go with your lower tax idea. How could having a lower tax in that area, just for even the doctors that come in, how could that be a draw for them? Like, if we 
obviously if they're going there, they're obviously going to live there. So then the taxes for them are not going to be that high. Okay. Now, I don't know how high they are there, right? Because everything's different. I'm not sure. But what do you think? What were you going to say? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, so that could be a that could be a thing. The higher pay could be a thing, but how are they going to afford to pay more? The other thing is, let's say we go with a higher pay or lower taxes. So they choose to go there, but they're totally isolated. They're away from family, friends. I don't know. Even if I'm making some more money, do I really want to go somewhere where I'm totally alone? How could you address that problem? The more people go there, the more populated it will be. So what could you do then to try to get these doctors to come that if they don't want to be alone, if they don't want to be isolated from like their family or friends, what could you do? Uh, maybe. Maybe. Anything else? So maybe work out a thing where they could come with them? What else? What? What do you mean? For, but if you force people to go there, are they going to be happy about it? No. So they're probably not going to do a very good job, right? Okay. So, but if they if they were able to bring someone with them, wonder how you could use like vacations or something to help with it. Advertise something. Or even like what I'm thinking is if they paid a higher amount or lowered the taxes to get more people to come, how could they do anything with their with the doctor's vacation time to try to like encourage them? Because right now doctors work like really long hours, right? They don't get a lot of time off. They're always overworked. They don't have much. Time. Yeah, what could they do? Um, you know how you said how they don't get a lot of breaks? Yeah. You could um give them like breaks every once in a while. Okay, so maybe one. But I don't know who would cover for them then. Is there another way? Well, if there's not a lot of people there, then there probably won't be a lot of patients, so then they would have to work as well. Yeah, but it's a remote area, so um, they won't really need a lot of doctors. Will they? Well, in the remote areas, it, 